Hey everybody, um, I decided to do something with my hair. Uh, not because of the woman, just because I wanted to. Uh, it's still going to be another natural style. And I went on YouTube, because you know I love my YouTube, and I'm watching everybody's videos. And I, um, one of these other girls, um, that I've been, I haven't subscribed to her yet, but I've been watching a lot of her videos. I don't know why I haven't subscribed. I probably will after this. But, um, her name is For the Love of Updo's. There's like three natural hairstyle people that I follow, I subscribe to. Um, uh, and then she's one I haven't subscribed to yet, but I do, um, watch her. And so this is the style I'm going to try to attempt. I don't know if you can see it. So I'm going to try to, um, watch her video and attempt to do this hairstyle. And then you can kind of watch me try to do it and see how easy it is. And if it turns out, well, because I've never done anything like this. So, uh, if you're a beginner like me and you don't know what the heck to do with your hair because you never do your hair. I just don't have a lot of money right now to spend on getting my hair done because I'm trying to save every dime for this move because I still have to pay for the rental truck. I still have to pay get more boxes. I still have to paint the place and get carpet cleaned. And uh, a lot goes into movie that you don't think about. But I got to get the carpet cleaned. I got to wash the whole place down so I can get my deposit back. I have to... If I don't get to rent a truck, I have to rent some kind of vehicle or some kind of trailer to get this stuff down here. And not only that, I have to go to Maryland and pick up my storage there and then come here. Uh, and then I have to put on a huge deposit on my place. So huge that I might as well have bought a house. Um, which I still might be considering. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But... I don't know if I can get out of my lease and I already signed it even though I haven't moved in yet and I haven't given any money yet. Um, I signed the lease already so I don't know if I can get out of that or not. But if I'm stuck with it, oh well. I just wait to buy a house next year like I originally planned. But I just keep looking at all this money I'm trying to give away. and uh, I don't know. Anyways, to the hairstyle. So I'm going to watch this video and try to get it started, okay? And I'm going to like... I. I don't know if I can do the fast forward thing. So I'm a, um, because I don't have my editing stuff. So I'm going to try to like do some parts of it. And then I'm probably like pause and skip to the other part. Like I'll show you one part I'm doing and then pause to the other part. Okay. And then I'm going to link her video if you want to try it on your own because I'm pretty sure this tutorial isn't going to be that great. So, I mean, I don't have the right lighting. It's blurry. Um, I try to put a lamp behind this. I got the lamp here. I mean, there's just shadows everywhere. Um, so, definitely her video is going to be a whole lot more, um, a whole lot better quality. I just, my video is just to show you if someone like me, someone who's never done anything with their hair before on their own, can, and if it turns out like hers, if it turns out as pretty as her style is on her video, then you know that you can also do and you can kind of see the difficulties I might be having, the difficulties you might have in trying to trying to stop. So this is what this video is for. This video is not an actual tutorial on her hairstyle because um, this hairstyle looked like it took her a while. She time lapsed it, so she sped it up so that uh, it doesn't seem like that long, but I can't speed up my video. So and I don't want this video to be 30 minutes long, okay? So, I'm going to get my hair prepared and then I'll come back. By the way, I wanted to say, I got a couple things. I got these clips. As well as some combs. Real quick. Let me pause her. So, I got these clips. I bought the this for the first time. I haven't tried it before. It is the Olive Oil Ores Natural um, Hair Braiding Hair Butter. And I read the ingredients and it has a lot of good stuff. It's infused with ghee butter and coconut. Uh, I like, the smell is really good. I like the texture. That's my fingerprint. It's smooth and silky. It's not hard like shea butter. Um, so, I just wanted some extra moisture. This was not cheap either. It was uh, $13, so this better be good. And it's not that big of a container. It's four ounces. Um, but I do like the ingredients in it. It's, I don't know if you can read these ingredients, but it's not bad. I don't see anything really bad in it. So I always pay attention to ingredients. Um, I also got this for the edges. Um, this one is a little bit more nourishing. It's by Organics. 
doesn't have anything drying in it. I did read the ingredients on this one as well because there is one thing I'm going to use that isn't so healthy and I want to put this on first. Uh, I want to put this on first to kind of just protect the hair before I put on any product that's not so good. This is the one I think is not so good. Um, it also doesn't have anything too, too bad in it, but it's, you know, it's basically a firm hold gel. So I just don't trust gel. I don't care how the ingredients are. I don't know why. I don't know what is in it that's making it so firm. I don't trust it. So, but I got this. And they had three levels. They had the uh, super hole, firm hole, and this is extreme firm hole. This is the, supposed to be the, the strongest that they have. So I'm gonna test it out, because I've actually, this is kind of new at that store that I went to. And it says no flaking. Uh, I don't know if you can see the ingredients. I'll put it there. But it isn't too, too bad. Uh, and this one was um, $11.99. It's not on here, but I know it was $11.99. It was not cheap either. Uh, and this one I forgot to tell you, this one was $5.99, okay? And I got some rubber bands for this hairstyle. I have my brush, my comb, and then my edge brush that I'm also going to use uh, this to part, okay? Um, I got some black strips to wrap my hair at the end. Also bought some cute earrings for when I'm doing my style. I had to buy small ones because you know I'm in the I'm, I work in a call center now. And I got bobby pins. I have these, I got the fatter ones because I don't like the thinner ones, they break off your hair. So these are really, really fat. I don't know if you can tell how fat, these are fat, so they won't break your hair off, you know. Cause um, before, you know, years ago, I used to use those smaller ones and they would like, I would pull it off and half my hair being in it. It almost like it cut, like almost right through. My hair got shorter. Also, back in her video, she only put two packs. I didn't trust this because this this one is not as thick. And, you know, this I, I don't know. I don't know if I like this store I'm going to here in Augusta. There was one in Atlanta that I loved. So cheap. They had a huge sale on their lace front wigs and everything. This one, they have no sales, no deals, no signs of anything anywhere. And they're more expensive than the stuff. Like they're more expensive than most of the stores that I've seen down south. And almost the same price as the ones in Michigan. I'm like, you know, they had this really cute wig. I went online, that wig was $24. They had it for $50. And I showed her, I was like, every store has this wig for $24. Why are you selling it for $50? I said, do you match prices? She's like, no. But anyways, I bought three packs of these because this one seems really thin. And I just don't, I don't want to run out of hair uh, in the middle of this hairstyle because I can't do anything else. Okay? So that's what I got so far. Be back. Hey, everybody. I had to move into the bathroom my glasses have grease and oil all over it so uh hold on let me try to wash this off okay back had to clean my glasses so uh quick tips that i noticed uh, when i was doing this video it's hard to see where she's parting exactly so for this top part when you see that she's doing the square here here i noticed that um her part started right about where her eye, the end of her eyebrow style. So I went like this for the end of my eyebrows and then I part it right there. I don't, you can't see my part because I have it in the, the bun right here, but it's right here, which starts right here. And this one is, uh, it's in there somewhere, hold up. It's in there, it's just bun up, but it started right here and went up here. So, oh, there it is, I found it, it's right there. It'll look more, better once I grease it down and everything. And then, so I parted it in three parts. Don't know if you can see it. Let me see if I can turn the camera around. So there's that bottom one, and then there's one at the top, and then there's one here. Okay. One there. Okay. So if you, hopefully you can see that. I don't know. Um, it looks like a mess right now, but I'm hoping it out, I can clean it up with all the products I got. And then, so I started a part right here. And then I went about this far back. So I started from the back of my ear. This one, this part here, this part that starts right here, it started, she started it right above her ear and went that way. Just so you know, um, pay attention to that. So then every each part that I parted, I haven't done this one yet. So I'm gonna do this while I'm on camera so I can show you. I took the, uh, the olive oil um, hair butter and I just added a generous amount, so like I, I added a lot. So I just put a lot on my finger, and I really went from the 
edge all the way and then I got the roots too like a lot right on the roots just put a lot it's really silky I really like how it feels um so I then again I start from the part greasing the part too and I do the whole all of the hair and I grease it all the way to the end this is all the way to the end. I still have a lot of curls. Um, I've used this uh, rose water. Let me see if I can grab it. It's really good. So, instead of using regular water, I've been um, doing my twist outs, spritzing this rose water and glycerin on it. And it's, oh God, it smells so good. And it works really good. Um, and my curls, for some reason, just stay a little bit longer. And then, so I'm going to use the wider tooth comb. This is not as wide as I want. I forgot to get another wide tooth comb, but I'm just going to part it a little bit so I'm not breaking my ends off. And then I'll start, of course, from the end. I shouldn't lose too much hair. Let me make sure. I'm going to clean this comb out so I can... I like to monitor how much hair I'm losing the comb so it's clean right now. But my hair is kind of kinky. Yeah, it's going... It's not too nappy. Not losing too much. Okay. So, you're doing good. Okay. And just combing through it. Okay. okay, that's all combed through. Then I take this uh, Wild Growth um, Light Oil Moisturizer. It's very light. Smells good. The ingredients are uh, pretty good too. I don't know where the ingredients are. Where the ingredients are. It's Directions with ingredients. Oh, here it is. It only contains like five ingredients. So there it is right there. There you go. And so I'm just putting this just on the part. Falling around. Got two parts. One there, one here. That's for extra measure. Get this flat. I got one more curl in here. It just won't. I don't know. It's just gonna stay curly, I guess. Oh well. Not gonna worry about it. Oh my god, this is a thick, crazy mess. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, in this section, I'm going to use the uh, uh -oh. camera's phone. Sorry. Perfectly smooth. Um, Smoothing and uh, styling gel it says and controls on really edges, but it's a little bit healthier than I like this little flip top too. Here it is. So I'm gonna use this uh, first, and then if I have to, I'm gonna use that 48 hour uh, one for ultra hold towards the end, right before I wrap it. Okay. Uh, so I'm just gonna put this on the edge just so I can define my part. Because like before you couldn't really see my part because my hair is so thick. Okay. I wanna use this one. And I'm using a good amount. Sorry for all the ugly faces I make. Okay. Remember, where is that part? I can't see. I gotta get my mirror. So I'm just putting this. Even on the bottom. Smooth it. Okay, so this is how slick my hair got. Hopefully, you can see it. I don't know. I can go this way. And I just brush it straight from the part. And do this. I do like this um, black. This whole it looks black, but it's not. So, see in the kit back jar, it looks black uh, when you first open it, but it's actually clear. I like that. 
it's clear um it's really thick so i guess tomorrow we'll find out if this is 24 hour i mean 40 hour hold or not i will let you know i will let you know if it's hard flaky it's a good product or not so so far it's holding pretty good i got some strays here that i can fix later i actually don't think you're going to see those with the hairstyle anyways but so far it's pretty slick i think i like how slick it is yeah it's pretty slick okay so i'm gonna just do the this section and this section uh according to her video and i'll be back I think I got it slicked enough for now. I'm gonna lay it down with a scarf in a minute. For right now, I have to twist these. So, just gonna do a simple two strand twist real quick. And... Oops, got to keep my rubber band out. So I found these rubber, one rubber bands that um, they're not as small or as sharp, I don't know if you know what I mean. They're a little bit more, they have a wider band to it, which I think would be, I'm hoping that it will pull less of my hair up. So I'm going to two strand of twisters, all three of these, and I have one here and one here. And then um, wrap it in a little rubber band. Okay, so this is a little twist. Gonna wrap it around in a knot. So put in a little mini bun. See my little mini bun. And then I'm gonna wrap this rubber band around it, keeping it in place. Okay, I'm gonna do that for all three. One of my rubber bands just popped. I just heard it. I gotta fix that one. That's this one. Well, these rubber bands are cheap. That one didn't last at all. So what I'm gonna do is now uh, double rubber band this one because it's thicker than the other ones. Okay. Ugh. Gotta fix that. I'm not worried, too worried about it because I'm going to use my scarf to slip this down. It should be good. Okay. So, um, the reason why you see some of this pulling up is because I put um, some more of the body butter on it. And I know the butter counter reacts to the hold and gel and stuff. So, it, it, lets the, it keeps the gel from working as good as it's supposed to. But I don't care because... I just don't want my hair to be dried out. I'm worried more about it being healthier. I mean, I'm already putting too much product on it, so it's not going to be as healthy as not. But I want to be as healthy as I could possibly be. And so I'm not too worried about too many flyaways because I know when I when I um, uh, slip this down with the paper and the scarf. Sorry, I can't see some parts. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't see. So I'm just going to slick it down a little bit more. Now, in the video, she uses spritz, but spritz has too much alcohol in it for me, and I don't like to use spritz because it's drying. So, I'm just going to keep it as is. So, I got a bunch of these black. I got the wide one, the strips, for the wraps, and I'm just going to wrap, this, wrap these around, and then I'm going to put my scarf on. So, 
look like this. Practice this way. Put a little bit of gel just to hold it down. That's what I'm using, but I've never, um, I'm not a professional person to use these, so I don't know the real way you're supposed to use it, but that's what I'm doing. And I'm just gonna try to get as much of this area as I can. So, just slip it down. paper no I didn't mean to rip the paper but oh well I'm just gonna wrap this paper around here I'm gonna wrap this paper around this one call it there okay you know just improvise that's what I'm doing improvise and I'm gonna put one here for this one I like how long this is this one okay and she lets it sit overnight mm, I don't have time for that because I have to go to work in the morning so oh uh, I'm going to let this sit for like 20 minutes and I'm going to eat dinner and then I'm going to come back and unwrap this do the style and then wrap it back that's that's my plan for tonight uh, because I have to work and I need to be in bed soon. The only reason why I'm still up doing this is because I had to wash my sheets and they're not dry yet. Okay. So. See you guys in a minute after eating. I know this video is getting long. I'm trying to hurry. So. I took it off a little early because I ate pretty fast. Uh, and I'm getting tired. And I know I can wrap this up and hopefully get it. One rubber band broke again. These rubber bands suck. So. Anyways, I'm going to put one in the front. Okay. One that's going in the front. Okay. And then one is going, I have another one. I don't know if I like this connect line here. And I don't know if I like this store that I went to. They have some good products, but uh, as far as like moisturizing and stuff, and they have a lot of good selections, but the prices are higher than I want, and this connected line is not the quality I like. Even though I know it's connected line, it's cheap, and I'm not supposed to worry about it, but you know, it's really not as thick as I want it to be. Um, yeah. So, I'm going to start with the back one. Hold up. And I'm going to split it in two, and we're going to make two uh, twists. So I'm going to twist this one real quick, and then rubber band it, and then I'm going to twist the other half. So basically, you're going to have four jumbo braids, uh, jumbo twists. I mean, you're just twisting pretty fast. I want to just twist it normal, like really fast. No, I don't have to make. I'm not going to make it make it perfect. Okay, then I'll just use a rubber band for the end. Okay, be right back. Okay, so I'm gonna have to do this while I'm watching her, but I know this part, she basically rolled the tail like this. Kept rolling it and kept rolling it and kept rolling it. I think it was like something like that. And I wish I had the longer and ones. Create two jumbo twists. And turn her down. So I don't know if I'm gonna get trouble with YouTube watching her. Well, let's see. I don't want the one in there. Put this down. All right, everybody, <clears throat> stop recording because my battery's dying. I don't know if I can finish this before my battery totally dies.
I think I want it right there. So this piece, same thing. Uh, so I'm gonna roll this like a little cinnabon. And where'd she put that one? So she put it on top of the middle. I hope that looks good. We'll find out. I'll let them pause her. She's going too fast. She's going too fast. So this, I think this took me a little while. In her video, she said it took her like five minutes. I don't see that happening, especially since her video is, I don't know, like 10 minutes long and it's time and it's fast forwarded. I think her video is 10 minutes long. I have to look again. But this definitely took me a long time, mainly because it's my first time, and I wanted to get the parting exactly right. So hold on, let me make sure I got this bun looking straight. I don't know. I think it looks good. I don't know. I could fix it, I guess, if it doesn't. I'm not sure. Let me see. I don't know. I think it looks good. And I can fix it with body pins if I don't like something. So this part is going faster, but the parting and the slicking and everything else, that did not go that fast. So let me see what she's doing with the top part. Oh no. What happened? Hold on. Go back. She goes too fast. So... It does go a little too fast for me. So, I guess I have to take this one. So I'm taking this back one. Take one side. So she's doing a figure eight around these two buttons. She tucked it and then pinned it. Hopefully, if you see this, there we go. So, I guess if I wanted to have a little hair out, I could leave this braid. What do y'all think? Leave this braid out? I could use this other twist and pin it in a braid. Or pinning some hair right here. We'll see. Let me finish this style first. Then we'll see if I want to add any add any more. Okay. Okay, so I think it turned out pretty good. You let me know. I'm trying to give you a good view. Okay, let's see if I can give you a good view. There's no one here to hold the camera for me, so I'm gonna try to do this slowly. Hopefully you can see that side. I'm gonna show you this other side. Okay. 
Now, the only thing left for me to do, I'm gonna show you in the back mirror. So, there we go. I think it turned out pretty good. It's not exactly like hers in the picture, but for someone who's never done it before, I like it. It's hair is off my neck. It feels cool. It looks stylish. The old lady there won't talk about my hair. <laughs> and the uh, only thing left to do is I'm gonna slit. See these little, I see these little pieces popping up right here. And that's only because I put so much conditioner in my hair. So I'm going to go ahead and um, slick this down again and put my the black wraps back on, put my scarf back on, and then I'm going to bed. I think I might wear it like this for a few days and then um, to add a little variety, I'm going to take this third pack, make it into a long braid or maybe just keep it straight here and I'm going to have a ponytail coming off of this style just for some added variety. But again, I think it turned out pretty well. I like my little twisted full hawk with the little bun on top. Looks good. Okay, so. Okay, ready for bed. Wrapped it back up. I'm tired. I hope you guys have a great night. I might show you how I look in the morning. I'm thinking I might wear my contacts to work because these glasses are messing with my edges right here and it's, I don't want them to be pulled up uh, and be sticking out because the glasses keep picking with it. So I might wear my contacts, but my lashes don't look that great. And I don't know where my lash glue is. So we'll see you in the morning. I'm too tired to think about it right now. Bye.